this is a real treat for me to talk to you about ACE unit and um, I'm Deborah Janes. There's only two NHS places like us in, 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 in this country and we provide a very unique service. My name's Claire. We have become a more complex service. We can deal with pretty much all addictions. My name's Dr Tim Williams. All sorts of people come to ACE Ward from all sorts of different backgrounds, but all are welcome um, into the ACE community with open arms. We aim for a sort of calm, therapeutic environment where people live in a community. So we have peer mentors that come onto the ward and volunteers. Hello, I'm Sue and I'm a peer supporter here. I did an alcohol detox at ACE unit 14 months ago and now come back to volunteer. When you've been referred here by your key worker in the community, um, then we would ask you to come for a pre-assessment, then go through your contract with everything we offer you and what we'd expect you as a client to, to do. So if you'd like to follow me, I'll show the unit. Okay, so this is the AC unit. Before you actually come onto the ward, you have an introductory day. I've never been to a unit like this before. I felt so ashamed and frightened and broken but the lady who is the manager here is Debs she is just wonderful there's absolutely no judgment or severity in any of the staff's faces or attitudes we have um, meetings twice a day um, to ensure that people are, are orientated they're supporting each other we also have a smart meeting here and we have um, mutual aid come in, AA, NA and CA. I found the work groups essential actually um, because you know it helped you um, really think about your recovery outside of here as opposed to just the physical detox in here. We go out for a walk every day, we can do cooking, gardening, so there's lots of other activities that you can take part in if you want to. So this is the garden which is lovely. I spent a lot of time weeding. People chat and get together and you get to know people. This is the wonderful tree of recovery um, and it's so inspirational because there's a lot of encouragement for creative things here and, and a lot of people haven't had hobbies for a long, long time. You know, my hobby was drinking. Brings your confidence back, gives you some ideas for when you leave here uh, as to how to pass your time. And this is the relaxation room. And it's just generally a very peaceful, pleasant space, really. There's a gym on ACE Award if people really need to, to have that physical exercise. This I actually used, and I'm not a gym person, uh, and I enjoyed it. I started to understand what people say about exercise making you feel a bit better. There's also TVs and there's Xboxes and DVDs, so there are all those things as well. So this is the main lounge. Lots of craft activities as well. So it's a really nice space. A lot of people stay here in the evenings to watch TV together. In the ward round, we have um, the nursing team there and the junior doctors from the ward. And we invite um, each of the service users to come in and um, together um, as a team, we work out the best treatment plan for that individual. All of our treatments and our interventions are um, correct evidence-based treatments. We are a specialist uh, NHS provider. That means that we can offer um, the forefront of innovation in the drug and alcohol field, taking on board all the experience from um, NHS services uh, around the country. We have um, specific protocols for detoxing um, from a range of substances. Synthetic cannabinoid receptor agonists, more commonly known as SPICE, other drugs such as ketamine, and that includes novel psychoactive substances, GHB, um, methadrone, um, as well as more traditional things like cocaine and cannabis, um, which can sometimes be, be more difficult to access help and support for um, in other community services. We are able to deal with people with dual diagnosis, people with mental health problems um, and physical health problems, which uh, coexist with their substance misuse problems, as well as um, um, issues that can complicate a detox 
or, or reductions such as pregnancy. We can also do new innovations um, such as high dose transfers from methadone to buprenorphine. We've successfully detoxed people from these substances and, and help them um, access long-term rehabilitation and recovery what we do here um, on ACE Award is providing that care and support for people um, with, with more serious and special um, issues that can complicate their drug and alcohol use. We can um, provide innovative and cutting edge services because we are an NHS provider um, and because we have the access and resources from, from the wider NHS network across the UK. The staff made it fantastic. They, they really made me feel safe and supported. AC unit is special because every member of staff who works here actually wants to work here. We're a treatment centre. We enable people to go through medical treatment. But also, it's very important when people come to AC unit that they feel that it's homely and they feel safe and it's comfortable. And I think we have a really good healthy balance here which allows people from diff with different experiences, um, different ages, different backgrounds to support each other for the common goal of trying to get uh, closer to their own personal recovery. That's how I felt, I felt valued as a person. Even though they do this week in week out, it felt unique and special to me. It is not just a hospital ward or a unit, we have something very much more than that. There's not another place like it. Thank you.